When I began to post videos of vision and revelations in my YouTube channel, a brother called me on the phone and said, My sister, it seems that you have the gift of revelation and vision, in order to preserve this gift of the Holy Spirit manifesting in your life. Please don't be eating pork, because pork meat stifle the gift of vision and the gift of revelation in people. Back then I liked to buy smoky pork rib coming from Belgium. I always had this rib at home because I like it a lot. I heard this brother warning but did not take it seriously because I ignored him, he told me, in our denomination we don't eat pork. But since I was not convinced, I said the pig that were possessed by demon all die in the water, I don't see a problem eating pig, I said maybe this brother is right, but I don't really know if I am wrong to eat pig, I eat pork but don't see any stifling, I continue to eat pork meat. I was cooking these pork rib when I remember the word of this brother, but the way I remember his words seems like his words began to act in me, in the next occasion when I ate pork rib I noticed stifling and suffocation, when I noticed it I pray and rebuke heaviness, I rebuked suffocation and stifling that I was feeling, and it went away, in that week I was having conversation with the Lord almost every day and regularly, but when I ate the pork rib I saw that the communication with heaven was stopped, upon this realization, I initiated three days of fasting and prayer, as a result the heaven was opened again, and I began to hear the audible voice of God, this after undoing the effect of pork meat in my spirit, the Lord was already acting to teach me something new, because every time I ate pork rib there was upheaval in the spirit world and the heaven was shutting down and the audible communication with the Lord was stopping, and I had to start three day of fast and pray in order to restore communication with the Lord, and I saw that every time I was declaring three days of fast and prayer, on the first day I was dreaming that I was bathing and this washing seemed like purification and removal of stain. As a result of this washing and cleaning of impurity my communication with heaven was restored, it was a cycle, where the first thing was the eating of pork rib that I like so much, the second thing is after the eating of pork rib was the shutting down of heaven and the silence of the Lord, for I could not hear him speaking in audible voice. The third thing is that whenever I noticed the heaven was shut down, I would start three day of fast and prayer for the restoration of communication with heaven, and every time I begin this three days of fast and prayer I would dream that I am washing and was being clean from impurity, but I fail to understand that the dream of washing and cleaning in these three day of fast was not necessarily a good thing, in truth the dream of washing meant that I was been cleaned and purified from a stain and impurity, contracted by the eating of pork rib. I was happy to see that I was washing in the dream because God was purifying me but I failed to ask the question why did I need purification in the first place, and what is it that made me impure and stained, I came to understand that I was being stifled and stained by pork meat, when I understood this truth I decided to test God, I cook the pork in order to eat it and see what will happen. What happened after eating pork meat is that despite my prayer the audible voice of the Lord stopped, when I saw that I could not hear the voice of the Lord, that speak to me every time I am on my knees, immediately I began three days of fasting and prayer, on the first day as usual I dreamed that I was being washed and purified, when I had finished the three days fast I got rid of the pork meat in my house because my brother took all of them, even if I told him that it was impure. After getting rid of pork meat in my kitchen, when I fasted again for three days, I still dream on the first day I was being washed and cleaned from impurity, I said in myself, I already got rid of pork meat in my house why am I being washed and made clean from its impurity, maybe this dream of washing has nothing to do with pork meat in the first place, when the three days of fasting ended, my brother who came to visit me went to the kitchen and said to me, Big sister, I still see a sausage in your fridge, you said you don't eat pork meat anymore, don't you know that this sausage is made from pork, when he spoke that way I understood why I dreamed that I was being purified even if I already got rid of pork meat, really there was no more doubt anymore, already the Lord told me he does not like his children to be stupid, he want his children to be smart but I decided to test God again by eating the pork sausage, as a result I suffer choking, suffocation and heaviness again, 
Many times the saint become heavy, weak and stifled because of food of the enemy, the danger is that in that period of suffocation and heaviness you will not hear God voice even warning that could save life, there is no taboo in God but there are principles, we need to be in good communication with the Lord so that when danger come the Lord will warn us in advance and we will be able to hear his voice, in the Bible that I written in Leviticus 11 verse 7 and the pig, though it has a split hoof completely divided, does not chew the cud, it is unclean for you, those who are wise will stop eating pork meat, and will avoid vetel and crystalline water, many saint pray for food only ignoring water, but the enemy has already destroyed water because we use it every day.